a way of life that has kept the Cajun people happy and prosperous for generations. One of the most distinctive aspects of the Cajun culture is the food. No matter where you're from, one bite is all it takes. I, I like just about anything and everything since I came here. It's, uh, it's got a good taste to it. I like it. It's, it's excellent. We like it very much. What have you tried so far? Um, crayfish, etouffee, turtle soup. What else? Well, I've had the frog legs and uh, some catfish. Have you found a favorite dish? I like gumbos. Shrimp. Turtle soup. Turtle soup. Well, I couldn't make up my mind, but I tried the gumbo because it looks so good. It's just about the best I'd ever eaten. This is the very first time I've even seen a crab other than on television. How do you like it? It's uh, different from anything I've ever had in my life. That difference is just one of the things that sets this culture apart. So for the whole weekend, the city has been turned into a heritage display, showing the ingenuity, talent, and spirit of the Cajun people. The Festival Acadienne. It draws thousands of people from all across the area and even from other parts of the country, too. They come here for all the good food, if I can get loose here. Come here, Gambit. Come here and sit down for me. There's plenty of good food, plenty of fun, and a lot of things to do. Now, if you didn't make it to this year's festival, or if you were there but didn't quite to get to see everything, stick around, because right now we're going to take a look back at this year's Festival Acadienne. Well, first of all, everybody likes a good party. Everybody likes good food. Lots of people like to dance, and you can do it all here. I love this whole Cajun Jamboree. We're at the Festival of Acadiens! We're having a great time! <laughs> if you look around you, people are having a good time. They're learning things, too. They're learning about Acadian textiles at the Crafts Festival. They're learning what crawfish etouffee is at the Bayou Food Festival. They're learning about Cajun music. Many people have never heard of Cajun music at the music festival. It's, it's not just a beer bust. It is a fun and educational place. And if you look around, there are lots of families. It's family entertainment, and people are looking for that. Festival Acadienne is a lively celebration of one of the most distinctive heritages in the United States, the lifestyle of the Cajuns in Acadiana. It is coordinated by the Lafayette Visitors and Convention Commission, and Ann Wakefield of the Commission knows that the key to the event's success is variety and fun. It's basically a celebration of Cajun life. And after that, it's a celebration of our life here in South Louisiana. There are many, uh, many facets of the festival that are not strictly related to Cajun culture, but that are fun. So you can, there's a little bit of everything here, but it's basically a celebration of Cajun life, which is the best there is, of course. The festival is really a collection of several different festivals that combine to express the Cajun good life, which is full of good eating, good music, and good fun. But even though the emphasis is on the Cajun culture, a festival just isn't a festival without a carnival and midway. With all this color and excitement, it's only natural that any youngster would say his favorite part of the festival is... Riding the rides and eating the food. That's about it. You do get hungry riding those rides, and Festival Acadian is a great place to be hungry. Cajun, Creole, and several other ethnic specialties are the order of the day at the festival. The food 
always tastes a little bit better when you share it with a friend. But either way, the festival food is always a favorite. The food, the food is fantastic. The food is good, have a lot of fun, dance in the dust. <laughs> Dancing is a great way to work off some of that food, and there's plenty of traditional and contemporary Cajun music for dancing. Fiddles, accordions, guitars, and singers blend into songs expressing the spirit of Acadiana. Where else can you get that good Acadian music, which I love so much? You can hear it on records and everything else, but here you can see it live. We've been having a good time today, all over. Most thing we enjoy was the Cajun music. My first time really listening to kids' music, and I actually enjoyed it. The band's great, and well, the, the crafts are great, too. I enjoyed that. The Louisiana Native Crafts Festival is a showcase for the handiworks of craftsmen from the area. It is an opportunity for natives and visitors alike to understand and appreciate Cajun culture. Festival Akati Inn gives these craftsmen an opportunity to show off their skills to the crowds. And when it comes right down to it, it's this interaction of people as they share ideas and fun that makes the Festival Akati Inn such a giant success. The people were just lovely. It was, everything was just all as one. You know, everybody just became one person out here today. It was just beautiful. People from all over the world that comes out here, people that we invite to come out here to Lafayette, to the Kidiana Festival, from all over the world, and they come out here, and it's friends, friends of ours, and we just come out here to meet them. This is where they meet us, and this is how we get to meet them. It's a friendly crowd. It really is. And um, people are kind to each other. They'll smile. Strangers will smile at you, smile back. It's it's a good, I think, to me, it is a, it's a, an authentic expression of Cajun life all through the year during festivals like Hot End. And so, if you missed this year's tribute to the Cajun culture, be sure to keep it in mind for next year. There's no other celebration like the festival at Cotty End.